Hi guys, it's Ibizar episode today, bringing you 513 Ultimate Team Player Review. Um, now, you may be wondering why there isn't a squad round the man of the match, Barini. That is because, like an idiot, I delete, well, I um, sold the team, um, but I didn't sell Barini at the first time of asking, so I've kept him, put him back in the squad. Uh, so I'll just go for it anyway. Um, so in goal I had Weisser, left back Alaba, it was a hybrid, um, centre back, Bad Stuber, other centre back Samuel, right back Jonathan, uh, Cambiasso at CDM, right mid at Palas, right mid was Palacio, sorry, centre back mid was Coutinho, left mid was Asaidi, strikers are, well, were Sturridge and Barini. Now, man of the match Barini was, for me, standard. Um, just above standard. Uh, he had three star skills, three star weak foot. Um, I'll go through more of that in the uh, in game stats. Um, he's right footed, you can get him around 45k. He played 13 games for me and scored 18 goals, which is a pretty good goal to game ratio. Um, he had 84 pace. Now, was, he did feel pretty slow to be fair, even though he had 84. Felt even worse than that. Um, 77 shooting, sorry about that, was, <laughs> something fell off my desk. Um, 77 shooting, now his shooting from around the box, just outside the box, was absolutely amazing. It would finish anything, as you'll see in the goals. Um, 67 passing, not really bothered about. 79 dribbling, his dribbling was very, very good on the skill dribble. 42 defending his sent for heading. His heading was surprisingly good. Um, so he played really well in the team. Um, around the hybrid was very nice with storage up front with the pace um, so just going to some in-game stats now so guys these are the in-game stats of man of the match the Barini um, they're very balanced to be fair um, there is a lot of yellowy orange but there are, is also a scattering of green he's got 90 finishing which um, was one of the outstanding stats I think it was his best in-game stats and he was a very very good finisher um, but the physical attributes of him were amazing. They're pretty much all green. There's one orange and two yellows. But he's got three star weak foot, three star skills, which isn't the best. High high, which was always out of position, which is a shame. He's only 21. Obviously, he's Italian. He'll play striker, left wing, or right wing. He's right footed. Um, so now we're just going to go into a comparison to his normal card. So guys, this is comparison of his normal card, which was a 77 um, striker. He's got his man of the match. has got 90 finishing, 85 sprint speed, 84 reactions, 83 shot power, 83 ball control, and 82 volleys. They are the standout stats in his in-game stats for his man of the match. Now his normal card has got 83 acceleration, 83 sprint speed, 81 finishing, 80 positioning, 79 ball control, 76 dribbling. No, he's had a two upgrade, um, and you see he has one more pace, one more dribbling. Five more shooting, one more defence, two more heading and two more passing. So hope you enjoyed the goals guys, I'll come back in a minute to give my own view on him, so thanks.
So guys, this is what I think of the Man of Match Barini. In the um, squad, I did say it was average, but I've had a little think about it, and he is actually pretty good for a 79 rated card. I've given him 8 out of 10 for great dribbling, great finishing, great shooting. Um, they always stand there. Even though he's only got 79 dribbling, his in-game skill dribble is good. His finishing of 90 was spot on, and his shooting was really, really good around the 20-yard, 25-yard mark. And the only thing was he had bad weak foot um, and he was always out of position with high high. That's what let him down. He was always coming back. Um, so if you have enjoyed this play review, guys, leave a like and subscribe for more. There'll be another one out soon. Thanks for watching and bye.